Hi everyone, I'm Jeff Teague in Raleigh, North Carolina. Your complete car buying resource. Catch me at Fred Anderson Toyota. What's up? Look what I got here. The most popular car or SUV in the entire nation right now. The 2019 Toyota RAV4. It's sporty, it's rugged, it's luxury, it's class. Great gas mileage, plus it drives great. One of the features I love about it is the digital rear view mirror. It's new technology for Toyota. I love it. You're gonna see the benefit, the convenience, the safety factor. We gotta check this sucker out. Ch 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 check it out. Traditionally, when we're driving in the driver's seat, you look in your rear view mirror and you're going to see headrests in the way. You're gonna see tall backseat passengers or small backseat passengers and they impede your visibility so that you can see clearly and safely what's behind you. RAV4 gives you your choice. You can have traditional rear view mirror like it is now or if you flip the switch, boink, it comes on. Now you've got digital rear view mirror. It shows you an unobstructed look of what's going on behind you because there's a camera just inside the rear glass and it's facing outward. So you see everything, no headrests, no people in the way, and it's crystal clear. What great camera quality. I'm editing this clip in because I forgot to show you where the camera is. It's inside the power back tailgate. Right up here. Hey look, it's Fred Anderson Toyota. The most famous dealership in the world. There's the camera. And it's right there. So remember, this goes back to traditional or digital. Now, it comes with home link for garage door openers. And the other thing you can do is it gives you a menu of different choices or different orientations for the camera so you can do let's go over here we're scrolling we're scrolling you can do brightness maybe you don't want it so bright maybe you want it brighter push this and now it changes the orientation up and down and then we can go side to side as well There's my friend Kelly Wade. And you can also twist it on an angle. Oh, let's twist again, like we did with our digital rear view mirror. And then we can zoom. Boom, 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 boom. So it gives you different pictures, different orientations, just like that. It's really a cool feature, and like I said, it's very convenient. See my kingdom. I love this raised screen here because it prevents being distracted. You're not looking downward to look at your radio screen or your navigation. You're looking very close to where you'd normally be looking, and it's a big advantage. It takes a little bit of an adjustment time but it's really nice once you get used to it. Now look at this screen here. This is on the limited all wheel drive. This is the all wheel drive meter. Of course I'm in, I'm in sport mode. I'm in normal mode. I'm in eco mode for the best gas mileage possible. Let's see here. There's our normal view. It's really hard to see if there are cars coming. You can see my iPhone and my handheld tripod there. But see, it's really challenging to actually see what's behind you. I also want to show you road sign assist. It tells me that the speed limit is 45. I'm going a little bit over that. I'll slow down. And it outlines it if you're going even one mile an hour faster than that. Okay, see this here? We've got cars coming up, but we can't really see them, so let's do digital. Now, you can see everything. That 
is so different, so amazing, so incredible, so high tech. And that's why it's hard to go back to the traditional way when there's new technology that can do that. At a traffic light, I wanna stretch my legs. I have brake hold on. So it actually holds. See, I've got my foot off the brake and I'm holding at the light so I can stretch out my leg. And it does that for three minutes and then after that it switches to the electronic parking brake. But the reason why you'd wanna use this is it's nice to just rest your leg at the end of a road trip or a long commute, that type of a thing. You can see traffic lining up here. Love that digital mirror. Ooh, boy. Nope. Yep. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna show you the turning circle in the RAV4. We're gonna try to go back that way here. Such a tight turning circle. It's really, really easy. You can easily maneuver, navigate. Okay, right now I've also got on my lane tracing assist if you have on your radar cruise control and your lane departure alert, it will keep you centered in your lane. That way if you're distracted by something, See, I took my hand off. Kids don't try that at home. It's a controlled experiment, I promise. It does it for about nine seconds at a time. And I like to keep holding on after so long here. But that's lane tracing assist. It even does it, if you're careful, on highway curves. It'll continue the whole curve for you. But you really shouldn't try it at home. We all have heard that commercial, kids don't try it at home. Blah, 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 blah. Uh-oh, there's somebody coming up. Oh wait, is there somebody? Yes, there is. Let me show you a couple other screens here. That's the safety features there. Beatles channel, holla. benefits to sport mode is it gives you more responsive acceleration so as I'm crossing traffic here zips you right across and then I like to keep it in the best gas mileage so I put it in eco mode that was fun thank you everyone for watching my video I really appreciate it what do you guys think of that digital rear view mirror is it something that you want on your next car also, write down in the comment section what you think of this 2019 RAV4. Do you have one on order? Have you gotten one? What do you think? Check out my corresponding article at tournews.com slash Toyota. Also, check me out on Instagram. Follow me there at Instagram Toyota Jeff one Toyota Jeff one on Instagram. Please hit that subscribe button right now, especially if you like this outro video where I'm in the mirror. I love it. Thank you guys so much. If you're looking for a new car in the North Carolina area, please call me, Jeff Teague, at Fred Anderson Toyota, or shoot me over an email. Subscribe to Toyota Jeff YouTube channel now. Thanks, everyone.